This is a Scottish fold cat. Why do these cats have ears that fold when most cats' ears stick straight up? It started with a cat named Susie. Her parents both had normal ears, but Susie's ears folded over. Susie had a new trait because of a mutation to her genes when they were passed down from her parents. Each gene is an instruction to make a protein molecule with a specific structure. The structure of a protein molecule is important because it determines how it connects with other protein molecules. Interactions between protein molecules, like the way they connect to one another, determine an organism's traits. The mutation to Susie's genes changed the instructions for the cartilage her body makes. Cartilage is flexible, bone-like material. It's what gives ears their shape. The changed gene made a different protein molecule for the cartilage of Susie's ears. Now, the cartilage wasn't strong enough to hold up the ears anymore. So when Susie was born, she had the new folded ears trait. And that is how we got the first Scottish fold cat. Mutations are totally random, so there's no way of predicting which genes will be changed or what kind of effect they'll have. In fact, a mutation may not have any effect on an organism's traits. These two flowers look exactly the same, even though one has a mutation. But in Susie's case, the mutation did have an effect. This is how Susie got her famous ears. She passed this trait down to her offspring. We have Susie's mutation to thank for the Scottish fold cats we see today.